Alright, what is up guys? Today I'm going to be counting down my top 10 list of onions. And these aren't just going to be onions themselves. They're going to be onion related objects or, or just anything related to onions, you know? So, starting with number 10, I'm going to go with shallots. And shallots, I mean, I don't have a lot of experience with them. I've tried them a few times. They're similar to garlic, but no, most people know the name, you know? Shallots are pretty trusty. Number nine, I'm gonna go with leeks. I, once again, I haven't had a lot of leeks, but they go great in soups. I know that in Asia, they love them. And Farfetch'd, if you know Pokemon, Farfetch'd is a Pokemon that uses a leek, so they gotta be cool somehow. Number eight, scallions and this is starting to get where I actually enjoy them scallions are really good but they're this low because I don't eat them that often usually they're just in like the only time I ever eat scallions is in cream cheese so like if I get a plain bagel or something <laughs> I uh, I would get scallion cream cheese and that's just really good and that's the sole reason they're at this level Number seven, I'm going to go with Maui onions, and a lot of people probably don't know what these are. I didn't until I looked it up for this video. So Maui onions are basically big, water-filled, and juicy, and that's nice. And like they get them from the soil or some shit, which is lit. You know, that's awesome. Um, and they're like apparently eaten raw. I I know I've had a few. And that's why I'm putting them higher than shallots and you know they're they're pretty unique and they look cool and that's why they get the number seven spot on this list now number six is gonna be white onions and I know what you're saying like that's crazy how, how are you gonna put white onions so low on this list and I know it's a surprise but white onions are really only used for burgers and salads and like they're very pungent when eaten raw you know I think they're kind of overrated, low-key, not to be controversial, but number five, onion rings, you can, but how can you go without onion rings, you know? They're a great tasting snack, they're not that healthy, but I mean, you have to like onion rings, like even if you're not into greasy, bad shit, every now and then, you gotta try an onion ring. Number four, sweet onions slash Spanish onions. I'm putting them in the same rank because there's a lot of debate between whether these are the same thing or similar or whatever, but or that Spanish are a variety of sweet onions. So I'm putting them together because too much controversy, but they're sweet, they're great for caramelizing, and they're used to make on aforementioned onion rings so they, they just have more use basically than onion rings so I mean you can't really go wrong with sweet onions number three red onions very common onions and they're just so damn reliable I had one last night in my salad I got a grilled chicken salad and I mean you you can't go wrong they're not too pungent or sweet you just always have a good time with red onions, with some salad dressing, you know? They, they go so well with so many things. Number two, pickled onions. Now, people might think this is gross, but every time I've ever had pickled onions, I, they've been phenomenal. Well, I get them on Panera's steak and arugula sandwich, and that shit tastes good. Every time I've had a pickled onion, it it's just been a good time like I can't say that for basically anything else on this list so that's why they get such a high spot if you haven't tried a pickled onion I very much recommend it and number one to top off the list number one is yellow classic onions they're so versatile it could be using guacamole sandwiches salads you name it they're very reliable and they're just one of the poster childs for onions in general 
A lot of people get these confused for white onions, but they are very different. They have a completely different taste, you know? And I'm very passionate about these onions. They, they are used in nearly anything and they don't get the respect they deserve. Thank you for watching this list. I know uh, it might be a little controversial, but feel free to let me know in the comments. I'll be back with more tier lists most likely. So uh, have a good night, you guys. Subscribe, like, comment, rate, whatever you want to do, bro.